Good morning. This is your media report for Thursday, September 3rd, 2015. I'm Sergeant Lori McGee, Media Relations Officer for the St. John Police Force. During the last 24 hours, police have responded to 80 calls for service. We would like to hear from anyone that has any information concerning any of our calls or investigations. We can be reached at 506 648 3333 at our email, police at stjohn.ca, or you can do it anonymously through the Provincial Crime Stoppers at 1 800 222 8477 or on their website at crimemb.ca. At 7.02 a.m. yesterday, police received a call to Red Rock Court for a report of theft. The caller reports the theft of a portable welder and a mini grinder from the back of his vehicle sometime overnight. There are no suspects at this time. At 10.25 a.m., police responded to a Harmony Drive residence for a report of a break and enter. The caller reports that entry is believed to have been gained through an unlocked kitchen door. Pop and liquor are reported to be missing. The incident remains under investigation. At 11.02 a.m., police assisted the SPCA at a Violet Street residence with the execution of a warrant to enter and seize some cats. The owner was present and the incident remains under investigation. At 2.15 p.m., a 61-year-old female was arrested for impaired driving when police were alerted to a possibly impaired driver heading in the direction of New Brunswick Liquor on Somerset Street. The vehicle was located and stopped in the Superstore parking lot. The female showed signs of impairment and was subsequently arrested. She was later released and will appear in court at a later date. At 2.20 p.m., a 22-year-old male was arrested for an outstanding probation violation file. The accused was released and will appear in court at a later date. At 4.30 p.m., a 37-year-old male ran into traffic at Millage Avenue and Somerset Street. He was struck by a vehicle and suffered cuts to his head. The incident remains under investigation with a charge under the Motor Vehicle Act forthcoming to the mail. At 4.35 p.m., police were called to an Anglin Drive residence for a report of a resident acting out and threatening staff. A 17-year-old male was arrested for failing to comply with house rules as stipulated in his court order. He was taken into custody and held for a court appearance. At 7.41 p.m. last evening, a 57-year-old male was arrested for violating his court order to abstain from alcohol after police were called to the Loyalist burial grounds for an intoxicated male who fell and struck his head. After receiving medical treatment at the scene, the accused was taken into custody and held for court appearance. At 8.13 p.m., police were called to Adelaide Street residence for a report of, resi uh, sorry, for a report of threats. The caller reports that a male knocked over his compost bin, and when the caller approached this male, he produced a small knife and threatened the caller. The accused, age 21, was located in the area and arrested for threats as well as possession of a weapon. He was held in custody for a court appearance. This will conclude the media report for September 3rd. Have a good day and be safe.